welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we've got one of our favourite types of videos, a mug collection video. So I have already made two mug videos on this channel. One was like the first pretty much video that I made and it was about eight months ago. And the second one was talking about my Christmas mug collection. And they are both still my most viewed videos on here. I mean, I'm still new at this. They don't have that many views, but they're still the most viewed videos. And since I made that one eight months ago, I have actually been buying quite a few mugs. So I thought it was time to do a little update. Also, I feel like that first video is a bit cringy and awkward because it was one of the first videos I ever made. And yeah, I kind of wish I could redo it now. Maybe I will, um, but still watch it if you would just like to see the mugs in my collection. But I'm sorry if I'm like awkward in front of the camera. I hope you'll forgive me. Um, I will link both those videos for you guys. I have got 13 new mugs to show you. Now two, I already had in my collection when I made that video, but for some reason I didn't include them. I think maybe one was in the dishwasher and one I completely forgot about, but the rest I have bought since then or have been given to me since then. I feel like we all know I have a mug problem, but I feel like you guys support it, you enable it, you appreciate it. This is a safe space for mugs. So yeah, please don't judge the fact I have 13 new mugs to show you. In my defense, I always try and only add ones that are completely different to what I already have in my collection. There really is no defense, even though I'm trying to convince um, myself and you guys that there is one. I just love buying mugs, I love collecting them, and I feel like you guys do as well. Like whenever I post with a new mug, on social media I always get loads of questions where's it from and a lot of you guys also buy the mugs that I've bought so I feel like you know this is a public service really you know this is this is for you guys to you know add to your own mug collection <laughs> anyway let's stop justifying it and let's just show you guys the mugs sit down relax grab your favorite mug fill it with your favorite beverage and I really hope you enjoy it seeing these updates to my mug collection Okay, so let's start with the two mugs that I missed from the previous mug collection video. So they are not technically new mugs, guys, okay? <laughs> the first one, we're just gonna just keep justifying ourselves during this video, aren't we? This one is a great big hug in a mug. I got this in Tesco. It's one of the Tatty Bears mugs and it's got the same design on the back and it's just a really lovely big size, a nice round kind of one that you can fill with um, a nice cup of tea in the morning. It's kind of just got very kind of cozy vibes. It feels kind of autumnal, that one. And yeah, it's just, it's just a lovely kind of cozy mug, that one. And then the other mug that I didn't show you before was um, this Pisces mug. So on the front, it says Pisces and it's got the constellation. And on the back, it's got 20th of February to 20th of March, imaginative, kind, selfless. I am obviously a Pisces, in case you <laughs> had any doubt why I've got a Pisces mug. And it's blue on the inside. And that one is actually randomly from Clinton's and I got it in the sale for like three pounds or something. And so yeah, really like that one. So moving on to new mugs since the previous collection. The first one is this Be Kind mug. Be as in Bumblebee with a little bee and a little heart and it's got gold edging around the rim and it's just that kind of nice tankard, is that what we say, tankard shape mug? This was a total bargain, it was like two pounds from Home Bargains, which is always a great place for a little mug bargain if you need one. Um, and yeah, it's really cute, and I've actually got a t-shirt that says Be Kind, so that always makes me happy. Um, and then the next mug that I don't think I showed you in the previous collection was this one, which is also from Home Bargains. I need to make another trip to Home Bargains, haven't been so long. Um, it is PJs all day got the same design on the back again I think it's like two pounds and you know that I do love getting in my PJs from about 6 p.m most nights so you know I thought that was a pretty appropriate mug for me I think we'll all agree on that one and then moving on for another kind of real kind of wintry lovely mug it's my first ever clear mug I feel like these are becoming really trendy at the moment and I see them everywhere and I never had one before so I've picked this up in actually a local garden center hopefully you can see on camera that it says let's get cozy and it's got the same on the back and it's actually one of the heat like, well, like a heat changing mug so when you put tea in the writing goes white 
and it is a massive mug. Like, even for me, that is a lot of tea. The only thing I would say about it is I wish the handle was a bit bigger. The handle's kind of small for the... So you can't do that. Do you know what I mean? It's not a great kind of fit for the size of the mug. But again, um, I got that in the sale in the garden centre after Christmas. And, you know, if you are a follower to this channel, we like our coziness, we like our cozy vibes. So how could I not get a mug that says, let's get cozy? I mean, like I had to buy it, guys. It was kind of, it would just be, it would have been rude not to. <laughs> So I realised at the start of this video, I said, you know, some of these mugs were gifted to me, basically to try and make myself feel better, when in reality, only one mug was gifted to me and the rest I did by myself. So yeah, we'll just move on from that. We won't talk about that anymore. But the mug that I got gifted was for my birthday this year on the 20th of March, and it was for my mum. And it's just got birthday girl in pink and gold on it. And the handle is pink. And she got this from Squire's Garden Centre. But I have seen them in like other garden centres and places. Um, it's a, it's called Celebrations. So they might do their own website maybe if you are looking for that. So that was lovely. And then possibly some of my favourite mugs ever in my collection. And I know that is a big statement, but these are so cute. These are from the Disney store. <gasps> Marie from the Aristocats. And I just love it. It says, yes, I'm adorable on one side. And then it's just got a larger picture of Marie on the back. And it's just the best handle of all time, shaped like a bow. <gasps> it's just it's such good quality, great size, so cute, pink inside. I'm just absolutely obsessed with this mug and I feel like it might be my favourite, which is a big statement to make, but I just absolutely adore it. They've got some really lovely mugs on there. I kind of want more. I'm trying to stop myself. The second mug I got, what is equally cute though, it's a Winnie the Pooh one. So on the front, it says when it rains with Tigger and Winnie. And then on the back, it says look for rainbows with Eeyore. How cute is that? And then to make it even cuter, on the inside is a little rainbow. Mm, so sweet. I just, I just can't even deal with how cute that is. And then this one, I've seen these kind of um, decor at the moment with like abstract faces on, like all around. I've seen vases and things like that. And I saw this mug, I feel like maybe Saffron Barker or Anastasia got it for Christmas birthday or something. And I had a look and I found it on Amazon. It's a Sasson Bell mug and their stuff is really good quality. And it's just a cream mug with a abstract face on it in black. The back is um, just, what am I trying to say? Blank, clear, no design on the back. Um, yeah, I just really like that. It's really nice. And again, it's like a nice shape, good size. Tick, 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 tick. Had to get it, guys, had to get it. And then to um, complete the run of Disney mugs, um, I thought I really needed another Minnie Mouse mug. Um, just because I did. Uh, <laughs> God, guys, I've got a problem, but look, how cute is this? Basically, I was doing an Asda home order and their mugs are add-on items, so you can only buy them if you are spending, like, I think it's 15 pounds on other things. So I just thought, as I was doing an order, I would see if there was any mugs and I just couldn't resist this mini mug, especially because it's got the ears and the bow. So cute, although, <laughs> kind of just make it a little bit awkward to drink from. So maybe it's more of an ornamental one. I think it was like four quid, but as I said, you have to add it to other things that you're buying. But obviously in the sh in the store, I presume they sell these. So you can just pick it up with your supermarket shop. But also if I'm being really picky, the handle's on the back. So when you're drinking, it's not as nice as the front. I don't know, just a thought. Just a thought in the mug, in the world of mug designs. Yeah, yeah. Final three mugs, guys, if you're still with me. 
Um, these two I picked up literally just the other week in Tesco. Tesco suddenly got in some new mugs and they're all like two pounds. I kind of wanted to buy four. I made myself only buy two, but who knows what's gonna happen when I go back in. I can't, I can't make any promises, guys. This mug <laughs> I got basically because it's got a cat on it that looks like my cat. Yeah, these are the things that I do, guys. Look, it looks like Harry, my black and white cat. It's got cats all on it. How cute is that? Yeah, I am a crazy cat lady. So if you are also a crazy cat lady, you can pick this up for two pounds in Tesco. It is a really good size. And for two pounds, super cute. Had to get it. And then a kind of matching one, but this time it's got a giraffe on it, was this one that I got. Be your truest self, how cute is that? Same on the back. So we've got a little giraffe with flowers, like, because why wouldn't a giraffe have flowers? Be your truest self. I really liked that one, and I thought, like, it's very different to other mugs in my collection, so that's why I picked it up. And, you know, next time I go back, I will keep my eye out for any more mugs. And then the last mug that I bought very recently, in fact, I bought it this weekend for Easter. I went to the garden centre and I saw this lovely mug which has got a, um, I was going to say, <laughs> Matthew Williamson. That's why I turned it over because I thought that's not what it is, Vicky. No, no, no. William Morris print on it. How gorgeous is that? The Strawberry Thief. Hopefully you can see the detail of the birds and the strawberries and everything and the gold edging. I thought that was so lovely and I couldn't believe it goes in the dishwasher and it was four pounds. I was like, oh, I picked it up and I thought, oh God, it's going to be like 15 quid. I just know it is because there's like some mugs in Waterstones that have got the William Morris thing on and they're really expensive. And I couldn't believe it was four pounds. So, you know, I had to, I had to buy it. Like, I don't know. These are the justifications I make to myself, guys. But it's just too pretty. I just had to. I'm sorry. So there we go. Those were the 13 new additions to my mug collection that I wanted to show you today. I really hoped you liked them. Let me know what your favourite mug was. And if you are also a mug collector, maybe I have inspired you to buy a mug today. Let me know. And let me know if you've got any of these mugs in your collection. And yeah, if you haven't already, go back and watch my other mug collection videos. But as I say, I'm sorry if they're a little bit cringy. Um, yeah. I really hope you enjoyed it. I don't know why I love collecting mugs. I think they just bring me a little piece of joy and I hope they brought you a little piece of joy today as well. Let me know. If you're new to this channel and you are a fan of mugs, then please do subscribe because I feel like we are, we're just friends. Like if you like mugs, we're just friends. That's just, that's just what we say on this channel. So join us, be our friend and I will hopefully See you soon for another video. I'm going to go and put some tea in one of my mugs now. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Take care, look after yourselves. See you soon. Bye. Mm -hmm.